Hey you guys, it's Katrina here with Spoken Interiors and I want to welcome you guys back to our crowning series where we're talking about all things drapery. And so with our crowning series, we're talking about what we're doing to the top portion of our draperies. And so today we're going to talk about the cartridge pleat. And so within the cartridge family, there's two types of pleat. There's a cartridge pleat and then there's a goblet pleat. And with those two, what your seamstress is basically doing is taking about seven, five to seven inches of fabric and then they're pleating it. And then they're taking uh, a crinoline material and I want you guys to see this material coming out of this pleat. It's a crinoline material, a plastic material that they're gonna insert and so that fabric stands firm, all right? And so when they do that, it's gonna create a, uh, a halo or a tubular uh, form at the top of your pleat and that's going to give you a nice bellow at the end a nice fullness also you also have the goblet pleat and they're going to have a crinoline as well and so i just want you guys to see the crinoline so you know exactly how your draperies are made they're going to have the crinoline as well but they're going to cut it down about two inches shorter than your cartridge pleat because they're gonna put a three finger pinch pleat like we talked about last, last week. Um, they're gonna put a three finger pinch pleat at the bottom just to give it a little bit more um, definition, also to give it a little bit more pizzazz um, than your cartridge pleat. And I've actually seen this type of header done in a contrasting banding. I've also seen a button placed on the side of the, the butterfly pleat at the bottom. So there's a lot of different things you can do with a cartridge pleat and it'll give you a nice bellow at the end. Um, it'll give you a nice flare and fullness to your drapery. But I want you to keep this in mind that a cartridge and a butterfly pleat is very dressy. So it's very traditional. Uh, you should keep them in formal settings. And if you want to bring a lot of attention to the top part of your drapery, a cartridge pulley is definitely the way, it, the way to do it because it's very three dimensional. So this is what a cartridge and a goblet pleat looks like. You guys let me know if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. And as always, thank you for watching. Hit subscribe if you wanna see more. Share this video and I'll see you guys next week to talk about inverted pleating. So for all you guys who like more minimal look, next week is definitely what you want to tune into. I'll see you next week. You guys have a great day and create what you love, but love what you create, okay? See you next week.